Hey guys, I know it's been a while, but I'm here to show you guys three of my all-time favorite products from Icon Cosmetics. So of course, it have to do with the brows. I'm gonna go in with the new retractable brow liner in the number four, I think that's dark brown. First of all, I love the new sleek silver look. You see that it has the brow pencil on one side and the spoolie on the other. And then I just did a little swatch for you to see the texture of the actual product. I'm just going to go in and line my brows very, very lightly. Okay, so lately I've definitely been loving a lighter brow. And I love the fact that this pencil, even though it's dark brown, it doesn't give that harsh black almost look that has most dark brown pencils. So I'm just going to do the same thing I did at the bottom and I'm going to create a line on the perimeter of the top of my brow and then just connect it to the end. Now that I've got some of a decent shape going on, I'm going to go in and just fill in those little ball spots in my brow. Don't judge me. And this is what it looks like once it's filled and then before, of course. So our next product, if you, if you know, you know this Brow Slay Wax. I am literally always raving about this. Listen, y'all, don't walk to Beat Studios, run to Beat Studios, okay? Because you're going to need this Brow Slay Wax inside your life. So usually I just take some on the tip, tippy end of a little spoolie and just brush it through my brows and I just play with it and work with it until my brows are slick and in the shape that I require. Now some people like to put on the brow slate wax before they fill it in, but this is just what works for me. And voila, there you have it. You could literally already see a difference in the consistency of my brow. This is just a product that I cannot live without. It just adds that last finishing touch to a perfect beat. Okay guys, so I have here with me two of the Don't Move concealers from Icon Cosmetics in shades Chestnut and Walnut. Walnut is the darker one. And I think that's the one that I'm going to use today. So let me show you all how to use the Don't Move concealers. Okay, so I don't know about y'all, but I love a convenient product. I believe in working smart and not hard. So I love the fact that these concealers already have the little applicator brush. I just apply it in every area that I would want to highlight on my face. And notice that I'm working really quickly because this concealer does dry y'all. Like super, 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 super quick. You can slap up with this. Apply your concealer in all the areas you would want to be highlighted and immediately you need to start blending. Another amazing feature about the Don't Move concealers is that the consistency, like the texture is so smooth and a little goes a long way. You really don't even need a lot of product. Okay, so I blended everything out but I do want to brighten up my face some more. So I'm going to go in with the lighter shade chestnut. Like I said, guys, a little goes a long way. And I'm just gonna go straight in with my eye on the blender. Okay, okay, okay. I know I said three products. But this is just like, think of this as honorable mention. This is a bonus feature because you gotta set the face. Now this Icon Cosmetics setting powder, literally look at how that melts into the skin. I just took the same beauty blend I used earlier, put some powder on and just keep working it in until it disappears. And here we have the finished look. What do you guys think? I'm sorry, but with these products that were featured today, you literally cannot go wrong. Don't forget to use my code when shopping Icon Cosmetics. I won't go like this. I won't go like this. Uh -huh. Ladies, uh -huh.